Welcome back to Interesting Powders. Mm. Today's interesting powder, we have a nice chemical C4, apparently. Yes. Looks like Otherwise mustard. Otherwise known as mustard powder. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> Otherwise known as wasabi powder. <laughs> I don't know if that's a thing. Let's see, what's on this shelf? There are all kinds of dietary supplements and different medicines. <laughs> also a poison. Drink we found in the right also room. a poison. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, <laughs> it's just in there. Right it's there. just on the left. Come okay. on, guys. The protein drink we found in the record probably came from this shelf. All the containers on the shelf are labeled with the letter A and number. So I guess I can consider this part of the shelving unit section A. Huh? huh? But, wait. but wait. There's more. There's one bottle here that's labeled Chem C9. Could someone have put it here on accident? <laughs> uh, maybe. Okay, so these footprints weren't made before the murder. They were made after the murder, the person trying to cover it up. Oh, and put in it their back. haste, they accidentally yeah. knocked over the bottle and then put it back in the wrong place. Sounds like a Hina move. That, yeah, sounds like a Hina move. So on this shelf is, the Hina has bigger, no, no, we have bigger feet than Hina. Looks like a bunch <laughs> of chemicals that I have no idea what they are. Don't matter. <laughs> the Regents. Put simply, they're used in experiments to bring about a chemical reaction. Are they called regions? How have you lived in such ignorance for so long? It must truly be bliss. It, isn't that kind of harsh? What, you think studying science and mathematics has no practical application in the real world? The words of a lifelong loser, which I suppose suits you well. Mike, were you saying reagents? Yeah, like reagents. Oh, maybe that is reagents. I said reagents. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even say that. Anyway, that doesn't <laughs> matter. Right now I need to focus on the shelf. All the containers on this shelf are labeled with letter B and a number. So I guess I consider this part of the shelving unit section B. <laughs> or you just yes. look at the sign. Okay. I don't see anything out of the ordinary here. In which case, I don't think I have to worry too much about this shelf. What about shelf C? On this shelf is... One look at I can tell it's nothing but dangerous chemicals. These look like poisons and other powerful chemicals. All the containers on this shelf are labeled with letter C and a number. Like so I guess C, I right? can consider this part of the shelving unit section C for poison. <laughs> for soison. Poison. I should try to find out more about the shelving unit. Where was it made? Ikea. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> How do you make a shelf? <laughs> Looks like it's, it's split into billy. three sections. Section A has dietary supplements. Section B has reagents. And section C has lethal chemicals. Sakura must have gotten the protein powder from section A. What concerns me is that section A, there was a bottle in a label from section C. What was a bottle of poison from section C doing in section A? I don't know. That's weird. There's definitely something going on here. Yeah. Something smells mustard powdery. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. I've already taken a good look at the chem lab. Maybe I should take another look around the rec room. Why is there a broken bottle on the ground, though? Like, who did that? I guess in their haste, maybe they knocked it over by accident. From where? From um, C. C, maybe? Like, then why didn't you just put the powder back or the, put the poison back in C? I don't know. I feel like that kind of, that the way it broke, that's... Like that would have been a lot of force that would have had have been like exposed. It would have fallen from a high angle. Yeah. Yeah. That's More a lot coffee. Of stop yawning, Ben. <laughs> a lot of splash damage, if you know what I mean. You know, I know what you mean. Yaki, yeah, okay, what do you have to say about splash damage? Should we talk to him? Did we talk to him already? Splash damage. When we damage entered, is the most he talked to us. Okay, well, let's start talking to him. Yeah, yeah. Let's talk to him. Yeah, that's good. When we entered, he talked to us. Okay, let's start talking to him. Yeah, that's good. Makoto, I admit, you have a good eye for spotting useful clues. Yeah, that's good. Okay, well, let's start talking to him. Yeah, that's good. Makoto, I admit, you have a good eye for spotting useful clues. Yeah, that's good. Makoto, I admit, you have a good eye for spotting useful clues. But you also need to learn how to make use of those clues. Okay. All right. That's. Touching, Are clues truly useful if you don't know how to use them? <laughs> That's true, I guess. I mean, we again, we did say that Makoto's very good at like spotting things, but not really good at like figuring out what they mean. Mm -hmm. yeah. Which Byakuya is just uh, reflecting our thoughts. Yeah, as always. As, as always, always. Byakuya says what all of us are thinking. <laughs> He's the he's the voice of the people. Now remove your yourself from my side. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to <laughs> look at you anymore. All the time when I'm at the mall. <laughs> Too many people. Please remove yourself. Please, from please my remove side. yourself from my side. <laughs> Where are we going next? Uh, he said, check out the rack room again. Okay. So Makoto, how's your investigation going? Yuck is being mean to me again. <laughs> oh my god. We found out that the shelves are made from yeah. IKEA. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah. A, I B, and out C. There were three shelves yeah. combined into one. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> I told Kyoko and Toko and Hiro. I told Kyoko what Toko and Hiro had told me. I see. So along with Byakuya, they're both claiming that they didn't go see her. All terrible liars. Except that Hiro is very much lying. Yeah. It's too convenient. Someone must be lying. I bet it's Hiro. <laughs> Someone's <laughs> lying. Well, I've made some progress on my own. Hello. Remember how I said I was going to touch the body alone? Yeah, I've confirmed that Sakura is a woman. Mm. Sakura's body, the shelf of magazines, and the Monokuma bottles. 
These three things have revealed new clues. You do well to look them over one more time. Okay. Oh, all right. Cool. That's hey, baby. According to Kyoko, there's still something to be discovered from Sakura's body. Just, our, it's just staring off into <laughs> space isn't going to help you figure anything out. Well, well, yeah, I know, but... Don't you think that you might need to actually <laughs> examine the body? Hey, Kyoko, don't drag <gasps> me into your so case. She's so into it. Yeah, she's very into, into this uh, post-death examination. Do you understand that there are muscles on her body that don't <laughs> exist on the human form? There's no getting around it. Unlike me, Kyoko didn't recoil at the thought of touching a dead body. She was completely unemotional. The kind of thing I've grown up, I've grown perversely used to. Ew. <laughs> Although there are still some times... I can't believe how calm you are. No matter how many times I see a dead body, I can't get used to it. That's totally normal. And how can you... I imagine it's because I've had plenty of opportunities to touch <laughs> dead bodies in the past. Is she necrophiliac? What? No, she's not a necrophiliac. She probably, like, helps out at a lab. Oh, yeah. Sorry, never mind. More importantly, look Whoa. here. Uh -huh. Vomited. The yellow mustard. Her shoes? You see that yellow powder in her insep? Wait, that wouldn't even require us to like touch the dead body. She's like, touch it, touch it, touch it. Uh, oh, by no. the way, if you just looked, there's some powder <laughs> on her shoes. Yeah, it really stands out. That powder is clue number one. Nice. nice. Yellow powder is meant to the truth bullet section. Okay. Next is the wound to her head. Look carefully. It's true. Actually, even telling you that it's incredibly difficult to but spot, so let me just explain. It would appear that she didn't suffer a single blow, mm. but instead received two blows to the head. Two blows? Interesting, wouldn't you say? And there's one more interesting thing. Both of her hands were spotless. There's absolutely no trace of blood on either one. So what I learned from examining her body in detail. Nice. Oh, that was not the beginning of a statement. <laughs> I can't believe she was able to learn all that just by looking at her body. I don't think anyone but Kyoko could have pulled that one That off. was not hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the mustard and the shoes especially. It's like, oh yeah, her white shoes have some yellow on yeah, them. Yeah, um... Seems... Oh well, Makoto, you silly goose. You All silly right. sweet Magazine creature. rack, what do we got? Scenes. Kyoko said the magazine shelf was hiding a clue of some kind. Hmm, clue, clue. Huh? This the magazine is upside, upside down. down. What? Naruto, ladies! Did someone put it that way? <laughs> yeah. Did someone... <laughs> Oh my god, it actually it says, it, it it's doesn't say that. It's almost Naruto. It's almost Naruto yeah. ladies. Kakoto ladies? Kakuto ladies, yeah. Did someone put it back that way on accident? If something catches your eye, it's important for you to explore that in detail, don't you think? Yeah, you're right. How many murders have you been through? <laughs> I picked up the inverted magazine and flipped through it. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah. Okay. This is... On one of the pages near the center of the magazine, a word had been written in blood, in bold, bloody letters. I almost thought that said blood, bloody letters. Bold. <laughs> Italic letters? Yeah, and it said, what? Toko. Could this be a dying message? And it would appear you found it. Kyoko, is this? It is indeed a dying message. Someone used their finger to write it. Dying message. Who's dying in this room? Yeah. To be clear, I'm not the one who put it back upside down. It was already like that when I found it a little while ago. I made sure to put it back exactly as I found it for the benefit of others who might come looking. I don't know if that's... okay. <gasps> hey, is that... that says Toko, right? You were worried it said Hina. So it? Toko did it! No, yeah, it looks say. like it. <laughs> then she's the killer, right? Mm, Hina, I think, I think Sakura was covering uh -uh. your ass. No, definitely not! Well, it hasn't been confirmed yet. It's settled. She's the killer for sure. Every single time. That's conclusive evidence, right? We can use it to corner the killer. I can see why you would think that, but it just seems too easy. If anything, it makes me that much more suspicious. Nice. All right. What's well, last one? The bottles? Yeah. Right. I think Kyoko said she found a new clue involving the Monokuma bottles. If it's... Oh, my God. If it's very obvious, I'll be mad. Like if, new, if it's obviously new. like, oh, the bottle on the ground came from these bottles. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Where's the night? <laughs> Did you figure it out? There's a hidden correlation. Oh, my God, it is. <laughs> There's a hidden correlation. It's the night. Yeah. Have you ever played chess? Um, Have you played chess? Are you dumb? <laughs> hey, Kyoko, can't you just tell me what it is? You're so dumb. 
I don't mind guiding you towards clues, but giving you my conclusion is not a good idea. Each person needs to come to their own conclusions so that everyone can have confidence in the outcome. That's very true. Yeah, but also it's like you're basically giving me your conclusion by like goading me in a certain direction. Was there a bishop? No, Was there a I'm queen? not. <laughs> not there at might all. be a, This there, is how politics works, by the right, way. Right, right. No, absolutely. There's a missing piece. Yeah. Well, that that's the piece we found on the floor. Yeah. No, no, no. Well, there's the pawn, the rook, the oh, knight. Oh, you're saying there's more bottles the missing? bishop. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the it's king not, and the queen. Right. And it's not just because you don't trust me, right? So. Hmm. No answer? I do trust you to a degree. Otherwise, I wouldn't have told you anything to begin with. Only to a degree? A bachelor's degree. Nine. Oh, wow. We don't even find the clue. It's just, yep, they're bottles. Actually, there's one other thing about the Monokuma bottles that's bothering me. I'd like to do an experiment to confirm it. You don't mind helping me, right? She smashes us yeah. with a bottle. Yeah. It's like, nope, it can't kill a person. They're sugar battles. Yeah. An experiment. Can you gather up the pieces of the broken Monokuma bottle? Try to get the smaller pieces, too. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, <laughs> driving no. glass with their bare hands. Huh? Are you sure it's okay to mess with the crime scene like that? You've already done a thorough investigation, so it's fine. And that obnoxious Byakuya is not <laughs> here, so... Anyway, I need to get something from the chem lab. While I'm gone, try to gather up all the glass. That Kyoko left the room. It shouldn't take that long. I really don't know what this is about, but oh, what choice do I have? I better just do it. I took the broom and dustpan and got to work collecting the broken bottle pieces. Ginger, ginger, great, ginger, great ginger, holy ginger, sound ginger. effect. And just as I finished up. Sorry to keep you waiting. Is everything ready? Then let's get to work. Oh, oh. she's thrilled at this. Did she get some glue? Yeah, really. So what kind uh, of experiment are we doing? I brought glue. Oh. I got a scale from oh, the Oh, are there shards lab. missing? We're going to use it to compare weights. Compare the weights of what? Did she eat the... the no, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that would be really crazy. Yeah. The pieces of glass you collected and one of the Monokuma bottles that's still intact. That would cause internal bleeding, but holy shit. Yeah, yeah, it would. Why do you want to do that? That's the point of the experiment. It'll make sense when we're done. Oh, wow. Look. Scale shot. Oh, nice. Product number 777. Yeah. First, let's compare the weight of the two normal Monokuma bottles. Hey, look at that. They're equal. Yeah. It's balanced. Which, Which means, means each, oh, each Monokuma bottle weighs about the same. Which makes sense. The Monokuma figures inside are basically the same, and nothing else could really affect the weight. Now, here comes the important part. Put all the pieces you picked up on one side of the scale. Now, what might we expect to see? Well, a normal assumption would be either they balance out or the pieces I collected will be lighter. I did my best to get them all, but there's a chance I could have missed some here and there. Okay, then let's give this a try. It's gonna be way heavier. Yeah. Oh, it's well, heavier. That's weird. So there's. Oh, so yeah, there were there were more missing bottles. You were right, Mike. Yeah. Or that bag is real heavy. Yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> true. Huh? The broken pieces are heavier. How is that possible? Well, she got hit twice, right? Yeah, yeah, so they were missing one of the murder weapons. Just as I thought. The other one didn't break, or the other one broken? It broke and they stole they the, yeah. Yeah. the piece. Why yeah, they, they the do figure. that, though? Maybe because that figure had blood on it or something? Something important? What? The result of our experiment and the correlation between each of the bottles. Put it all together. And I believe you will arrive at one very persuasive conclusion. Persuasive of what? <laughs> so what do you think? It's all on you. It's all on you. Oh, nice. Boy. Okay, cool. Oh, man. Is that it? Bong. Wow, yeah, this was a short investigation. No way. Is okay. that it? Jeez, maybe. Let's find out. <clears throat> Oops, you got me sleeping. Your investigation was just oh. so boring. I couldn't stay awake. Should I do it? Is it okay? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Okay, then let's begin oh, wow, the class yeah. trial. Are you serious? You know Damn. where to meet, right? Please go through the red door on the first floor of the school. See you soon. Wow. What? Already uh, time? But the mystery of the locked room is still only half solved. That's how I feel. At yeah. this point, whatever happens will have to happen at the class trial. Yikes. But, Hero! No, not whatever happens. I have to make something happen. Okay. Wow. Da Holy crap. Oh, I feel unsure going into this. Yeah. yeah. I don't... Uh, uh, this will be interesting. I feel like it is probably true that Hina did it. 
Yeah. I don't want it to be. I want there to be like a like a oh my god, look at all the stuff that's being revealed about Hero, this monster, you know? Right, right, right. I want that to happen. But I think it is gonna be Hina. I think it's gonna be Hina. Oh boy. Let's do this. Okay. Here we go, class trial time. Oh class my god. Class trial. So little people. Monokuma made his announcement and everyone began to meet up one after another. And then oh, maybe the, oh. Ooh, the ultimate martial artist. Cool winky face from junior <laughs> high school. A locked room murder mystery winky face. What? What the <laughs> Oh, I've just recently discovered the power of emoticons. Like, no matter how awful something is, if you toss in a smiley face, it turns positive. This got For weird example. and meta. Yeah, yeah, really. <laughs> You're at a picnic and you find a dead body. XD. <laughs> It's ha ha ha. This is just plain creepy, man. And how about the reverse? No matter how great something is, if you put in a sad face, it makes it look super negative. For example, do you have a hundred friends? T underscore T. <laughs> He's right. That does make it seem sad. Wait, how is this appearing to everyone else? Uh, I, I, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's, I'm like, that's weird. So weird. Wow. Now then, please get to the elevator. Uh, uh, lowercase o underscore <laughs> uppercase o. Oh god, I'll see you all down there. But your Kirby faces. Yeah, yeah, Kirby. <laughs> Kirby dancing. Kirby dancing. What the hell was that? I'll get it. I don't get you guys. Well, what? You know, huh? <laughs> I'm so mad about wrong. the murder. Oh yeah, that's right. We also, did. I use emoticons constantly. <laughs> How can you act so casual after murdering someone? Uh, I, I don't think I'm acting casual. Or, I mean, I didn't, I didn't murder anyone. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, yeah, I'm c completely innocent. How do, dare you call me a murderer? Whatever. Either way, the truth will be revealed soon enough. Was that a confession? <laughs> uh, No. Okay, You're just so like Hina now. Here's an alternate theory that I don't believe, but <laughs> I'll be mad if this is true, okay? What? What if there's, like, a weird, like, loophole in the clause about accomplices where, where each person, like contributes to the killing they sort of count as the black end and that's why there's like two blows to the head and poison because we've got three suspects and like Byakuya poisoned Sakura and then Toko and Hiro both hit her on the head once so they count as black end that's an idea I don't, really I don't think that, that there's enough evidence yeah. to point to that though yeah I don't like that conclusion anyway you're uh, dumb Jeff don't be dumb <laughs> god so dumb uh because there's gonna be no doubt <laughs> thanks thanks Byakuya thanks Beth Kia yes, hey yes, yeah, that's my true soul <laughs> There can be no doubt, one of us is the culprit. The killer, the one that murdered Sakura. In this room with us. Yeah. Oh, Golden it. statue. She was stronger than anyone I know. Oh. And yet, someone killed her. Alright. Oh. And that person is here? Is that person is one of us? <laughs> yes. Should we talk to them or should we just go? We've always just gone. Yeah. yeah let's let's just do it. Come on, it's time to put an end to this made my way toward the elevator. But with each step I took, I felt like I was moving further and further away from my goal. What's your goal? I could feel a chilling fear running through me, what do you trying want? to make me rock from the inside. Dude. Right? He's, what? What does he want? What's his goal? Get He's out. very out. Home? Yeah. No matter how many times I go through this, it never gets any easier. We climbed into our steel prison in total silence. Just, just like go going to work. <laughs> oh, oh, Michael. <laughs> we watched the doors close and felt it begin its sinister descent. Yeah, right. and then there were five, six, you know, <laughs> five suspects, and then us. The elevator lowered, uttering its all too familiar clunking sounds. I wonder what it's gonna look it like. Lower and lower, and as suddenly as always, the ride was over. The doors opened once again. Wow, it's got an Egyptian hieroglyphs. Yeah. Mm, what? Just the six of you, huh? Really? That's so few. You must be so lonely. Has that always changed? Yeah, because yeah, you used every to be, like time. moons and stuff. But like for each trial, has yes. it been different? Yes, for each trial it's been different. Wow. He always, he's always like, oh, look at what I've done with the place. Yeah. you like it? No, this time it's this. I've never noticed that. <laughs> oh. You say that like it's not your fault we're all that's left. I wonder, would the class trial end with one less classmate again? Or, uh-oh, will your school life come to an end completely? Now then, are we ready to begin? You know the drill. Find your assigned seats. Oh boy. And so the curtain opened for the fourth time. A deadly oh judgment, a deadly, deadly deception, de a deadly betrayal, a deadly, a deadly riddle, riddle, a deadly defense, a deadly faith, a deadly, deadly class trial. 
You'll get caught up in the <laughs> class, class trial. trial. All right. You want to yeah, save? Save. save at the data. Look at oh. all those dead people. <laughs> Look at all those former classmates. All right. Oof. Set skills. Yeah. Uh, I think we've pretty much, like, we've got extra SP. Yeah. What do we so, need? So, um, increase the time limit for each phase. I mean, that's nice. That's always nice. Steadies your aim a little. We need health, that's though. We need hearts. Are there any hearts? Uh, I don't think there's one that increases our overall health. Are we, are we missing so many? No, yeah, so we might as well just <laughs> We're great. This, We're really yeah. good at this game. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Might as well. Uh, okay. Cool beans. Okay. Should we review evidence or should no. we just go for it? No. We know it. Go for it. Go for it! Yeah, class trial! All rise. All right. Perfect. Let's begin with the basic explanation of the class trial. So your votes... So your, so your votes will determine the results. <laughs> uh, I just had a, if you can figure out the who done it, then only they will receive the punishment. But if you pick the wrong one, then I'll punish everyone besides the blackened, and the one that deceived everyone else will graduate. Now then, where to begin? We already know who did it. <laughs> oh, deja vu. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for calling that out. The yeah. one who killed Sakura is one of the people that hated her. Yakuya, Toko, or Hiro, it was one of you. <laughs> yeah. Idiot. I, I had nothing to do with it. Yeah, I'd never kill someone, no way. I don't want to hear your stupid excuses. Hina seems really sure that one of those three is the killer. She must have some reason for believing that. He always looks like he's having a heart attack. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's like, ugh. Always grabbing his chest. All right, here we go, round one. Uh, so Hina's account. We should probably check Let's to double check, check what yeah. that account is. Exactly. Uh, nope. Oops. one of you! There, that's how we do it. Uh, Don't shoot me with my own account! <laughs> Sakura had written notes to them, and she had slid those notes underneath each person's room door. That's it? Okay, Kay. yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, what have you killed Sakura? Okay. And what reason do you have for saying so? Because you all had a motive! You hated her! Is that it? That doesn't make any sense. Mike. That's the only reason you have to, for accusing us? No. Oh, what? Uh -oh. Oh, that, that's I didn't low. do it fast That's enough. about as low as you can get. All right, so hey, we need to shoot Hero Stadium. Yeah, it was Hero Stadium. I just Mike, wasn't fast enough. I, I, Step up to bat! It's cool, we'll just... Why do you kill Sakura? No, that reason. Because you hated her! That not make any sense. That's the only reason you have for accusing us? Boom! Boom, but That's wrong! <laughs> Hero, you idiot! <laughs> Great. <laughs> Another reason you suspect them is because Sakura wanted to meet with them, right? Yeah, and that was right before she died. So there's no doubt about it. One of those three killed her. I can't disagree with Hina. There's good reason to suspect all three of them. And does that mean one of them did it? I'm not sure we needed that preamble, but uh, I guess to make the trials harder, they have to have more of these segments. Yeah. Yeah. Pocket, pocket trash. trash. <laughs> hey kids, we need trash on the go. Pick up some pocket trash. All right. All right. The fact that Sakura wanted to meet with all three of them, there's no way that's not suspicious. One of you is absolutely guilty! I don't deny that she wanted to meet with us, but... I never went to see her. Correct. Yeah. I, I didn't either. Correct. Yeah, see here, I never saw her. Boom! Pocket trash. Pocket trash. Ooh, pocket trash. <laughs> Just pull it out of his pocket and throws it at Hero. <laughs> pocket trash! <laughs> Hero, when we were talking before, you dropped a small piece of paper, remember? It was white with red polka dots. Oh, well, what? That's got. What does that got anything to do with anything? Red polka dots? That's got to be a wrapper from the candy I gave Sakura. No, it's a. Uh, it's um. Ever since we got into the warehouse, I totally monopolized that <laughs> entire box of candy. So there's no way a single one of them was left in the warehouse. In that case, Hiro, where did you get that piece of candy? From Sakura! It's the only explanation! <laughs> uh, well, I mean, yeah, sure, I got it from her, but but she gave it to me forever ago. It doesn't have anything to do with what happened to her. When? When did she give it to you? Last time you saw Sakura was when Hina had to go to the nurse's office, right? Yeah, so I must have got it some time before God then. Damn. Oh, you dumb dumb. <laughs> but what Hiro said can't be right. 
because Sakura can only have gotten candy after the incident in the nurse's that's office. That's such a cute face, by the way. Yeah. yeah. A, oh, Makoto, you look oh, so cute. Totally cutie. The reason I know that is, uh, that's when Sakura got the candy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, that's yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. It was so simple. I was like, what yeah. is this a trick? <laughs> I'm not sure about that hero. He didn't actually give Sakura the candy till after she left the nurse's office. So if that was the last time you saw her, there's no reason you should have had that candy. Damn it! Or I mean, uh, what I meant was, uh... Oh, you dumb You creature. dumb idiot. Oh, that's right. I did meet up with her on the record. <laughs> you got a problem with that? Well, no, but the fact that you lied to her is super suspicious, yeah. idiot. Why at the sudden hostility? Uh, um, but we just talked. That's all. I didn't do anything. You gotta believe me. You were acting incredibly su suspicious. You're acting incredibly suspicious. More hostility. It's not just normal hostility. You're the real culprit. I even have proof. Whoa. Huh? huh? Proof? What are you talking about? I'm talking about her shining message. How do you know about that? Yeah. What would a shining message even be? At the scene of the crime, she had written out Toko in her own blood, right? It was her dying message, just like what you guys were talking about with Sakya. Would he know about that? He shouldn't. I, maybe. That's I mean, he true. could have been investigating. I saw it for myself. Mm, I guess they all saw it. See? See? Toko did it. W w what are you saying? N no way. I, d I didn't do it. Hmm. You just don't know when you're beat, do ya? Hero, hold on. When did you see that dying message of hers? Yeah, exactly. Because mm. she was in the room the whole time. Yeah. Huh? Huh? Well, well, when, well, when we found Ogre's body, duh. But if you recall, Hina was very adamant about keeping you away from the scene of the crime. So it's hard. So to it's hard to believe <laughs> that when you actually saw, that's when you actually saw the message for yourself. Huh? Hold on. When Kyoko found the magazine with the dying message in it, it was on the magazine on the show. Yeah, no. he's the one that put it back up there. Yeah. Now. He's an idiot. Oh, he's an idiot. Oh yeah. Kyoko, you found the message on the magazine shelf, right? That'd be a weird thing to do if you're trying to get a dying message across. That's right. Looking through the shelf, I found the magazine with the dying message on it. I found it right there, at the scene of the crime, after we'd started the investigation. That's true. Then what Hiro just said doesn't really make any sense, does it? Doesn't make sense? What? What doesn't make sense? Everything I said makes perfect sense. There's definitely something strange about it. Kyoko found the dying message during the investigation, in which case, that clearly contradicts what Hiro told us. What did Hiro say? He said that he found it prior. He said he found it during the investigation. Yeah, but, but he, he wasn't have. ever there. Yeah, because Kyoko was keeping, uh, sorry, Hina was keeping him back away from investigating. Okay. Yeah. So he must have seen that message earlier. I can tell you exactly when I found the dying message. When Ogre's body was discovered, and I can tell you when I found the dying message. It was only after the investigation had begun. Is this another flashback? I think you have to pull one. Yeah. I yeah. found the magazine tucked away on the magazine shelf. When I pulled it out, I saw her final words. What's your problem? What I said makes total sense! Alright, do we have to pull magazine shelf or do we have to pull after the investigation? Because like the magazine shelf I feel like would contradict it, because why would he put it back on the magazine shelf after he discovered it? I would. I, I'm thinking the other. The, the other, other one. Thing. All right, yeah. I'll try the other one first. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, but, but, but the clue was. But at that time, where was the magazine? I'll Let's do you magazine exactly. shelf. Yeah, then. yeah. I, I think I have to pull the shelf and shoot. Okay. 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 Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Magazine shelf. Oh shit. Grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Negative seven. Oh, got it. I got it. I got it. it. Uh uh uh. Okay. Take your words and throw them back at you. Yeah. He said he saw the dying message when he first found the body. But at that time, where was the magazine? Yeah. It's not the magazine. Yeah. I can tell you exactly when I found the dying message. Oh, his body was discovered. discovered. So, oh, maybe. Nice. Pow, pow, pow. Hero, pow, pow. Hero, you moron. We pow, 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 it. You fucking imbecile. <laughs> Such a when dumb Sakura's dumb. body was found, that magazine was sitting on the shelf nearby. That's where Kyoko found it, after we'd begun the investigation. And you weren't at the murder scene, so there's no way you could have seen it then. Duh. Tell us the truth. Tell us the truth, Hero. When did you see the message? Hold on, you're focusing on the wrong part. Why does it matter when I saw it? It matters. <laughs> All you gotta do is read the Vienna sausage Ogre left us, and we know who the killer is. Toko. Vienna, Vienna sausage. sausage? What? I don't even know where to begin with that one. <laughs> is that her big fingers? What? I got, maybe? Rude. 
Yeah. He, he's just trying to confuse us. Actually, can we even be sure Sakura wrote the message in the first place? Oh, no. Um, yeah. I think we can all agree Ogre wrote that message. Oh, he's so dumb. God, you're such an idiot. 100% without a doubt she wrote it. And this is me talking, <laughs> so you know it's true. God damn. Yeah. Without a doubt. Makoto's like, can I really trust him? Can I really him? trust uh, him? Everything he says is true. <laughs> no, I absolutely do doubt it. There's no way Sakura wrote that message. All right, so all are we right. going to contradict it? Ooh, Let's see, the moment, the moment of, of truth. Oh, 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 I have to oh, shout him down. Shit. Okay. Shut him down. Show me the proof. I'm at least 30% right. <laughs> okay. uh, the, the all cold is bullcrap. The all cold is bullcrap. Give it your best. Show me the proof. At least, I'm at least 30% right. <sighs> Reload. <laughs> the occult is bullcrap. Conspiracy, give it around. Show the proof. Why would he say that the occult is bullcrap? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's his Jimmy Jam. That is nice. Come on, show me the proof. I'm at least, show me. Yeah, yeah. The occult is bullcrap. <laughs> Give it a rest. Oh! Yeah, final strike. <laughs> Boom. 100% bro. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Break. Have we only ever broken murderers? No, because, well, I guess Celeste technically was the murder last yeah, time we broke her. Yeah, but oh. we didn't break her when we sure, knew. Didn't. Maybe. God, I don't know, man. That'd be so weird. That was so one of my two. I'm completely unconvinced that Sakura wrote that dying message. Because if you look at it, the message was almost certainly written using a finger, but... Oh, that's right. Both of her hands were completely free of blood. Oh, yeah, we didn't think about right. that. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Well, when we come back, we're going to continue on this yeah. trial. Oh, yeah. We got to find I'm out what that means. It. Cool. I'm just going to leave Makoto shaking here. <laughs> 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 